My name is Aaron Persley. I am the commissioner for the Kentucky Cabinet for Economic Development. Uh, I'm here at the Smart China Expo representing my state to try to bring stronger ties between the state of Kentucky uh, and the city of Chongqing. Thank you very much, Mr. Persley. And could I know what opportunities you already spotted from this uh, smart, during your trip to the Smart China Expo yet? Well, I will say this, you know, to be at this uh, expo of the centers on innovation is very important for us because Kentucky wants to be the center of engineering and manufacturing excellence. And a lot of things that are happening here at this expo really contribute to us being the center for engineering and manufacturing excellence. And so in Kentucky, we are big in the automotive industry, of course, in Chongqing. Yeah. The automotive industry is big here as well. So there's that natural connection between Chongqing and Kentucky in respects of the different sectors that are strong in Kentucky that are also very strong in Chongqing as well. So that's also the, would like to hear more, like in what areas do you think both of us can draw experience from each other, like the stronger advantage of each other and what are they to get mutual benefit maybe? Well, because we have numerous automotive companies in Kentucky, uh, we have Ford, we have GM, uh, we have uh, Toyota also based in Kentucky, also the strong EV auto companies here in Chongqing, there's a chance to transfer those skills between the two industries to work better together and actually increase our productivity in both those industries, both in Chongqing and in Kentucky as well. So I think a real partnership in the automotive area, uh, a real partnership between engineering and manufacturing and advanced manufacturing, I think will work well for us as well. I see. So could you tell us more about like the current situation and also about the potential uh, for the cooperation in intelligent industries between our two places? So really we were just getting started. So our first trip to Chongqing was in November of last year when we came to Shanghai for the China International Import Expo in Shanghai. Yes. Uh, while we were on that trip, we stopped by Chongqing as well to visit here. And that's when we started to look at Chongqing as an ex excellent area for us to have a partnership and build a friendship. And so actually Mayor, Ta Mayor Tang Tung came to Kentucky May of this year for the U.S. Governor's, uh, Chinese Governor Summit in Kentucky. And during that summit, we talked more about how our state and your city could cooperate and work together. Okay. And through that, we were invited to come back to the Smart Expo this year. And we're going to sign an MOU with Chongqing, a state city agreement, to talk about how we can collaborate through education, through cultural exchanges, and through business exchanges as well between our state and your city. I see. So, like during your trip, like this here, mm -hmm. will you, have you seen around over the exhibition area yet? I've walked through the exhibition area. It's absolutely impressive. One of the best exhibition areas I've ever seen uh, in my career. Uh, so, it's, you, you guys have done a great job with the Smart China Expo. I'm glad to see it growing year after year. I think it's the second year of the expo. I'm looking forward to coming back for the third year of the expo. Nice. So how about like the participation from your uh, state site, like mm -hmm. how they participate in the Smart China Expo and do you think the Smart China Expo will facilitate the cooperation between us and you? why, in which ways? Yeah, so our delegation this year is fairly small. So I came as a commissioner. I brought our Chinese rep, um, Bruce, Mr. Bruce Zhu, with me as well. And the person, Matt Tackett, who heads our Kentucky Association for Economic Development. He, all of our economic development offices are under Matt Tackett. So that's our delegation here at the China Expo, at the Smart Expo this year. Um, but I do believe that it will bring more cooperation between ourselves. And I think our delegation next year will be much bigger than it was this year uh, at the Expo. So I think the Kentucky delegation will grow and grow as we visit, visit the Expo over the years to come. Nice to hear that. Yes. And also, could I hear about your like, impression on the city, on Chongqing city as a whole? Oh gosh, so I'll say this, my very first time coming to Chongqing City was uh, literally last year. We drove into the city at night, and it was the most beautiful city you could see uh, at night. Even last night, we drove through the city, saw some of the sights in the city as well, walked through your downtown area. I am amazed by the size of the city, the beauty of the city, especially at night. I haven't seen a more beautiful city at night than Chongqing.